Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here. Just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. And here we have AC Milan against Real Madrid. I'm your commentator Peter Drury and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beck. Cheers Peter, it's a privilege to be here, it really is. Tries to think it in. Big moment! Massive goal! And some of the best managers I've played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. A pretty simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Menes just knew instinctively where the ball was going to end up. That's clearly been worked on on the training ground, and the understanding is, is pretty exceptional between them, and it was beautifully worked. Real Madrid trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Balotelli tries lifting it over. Carlos Baca goes through the middle. Casemiro plays a clever pass. Oh, good interception. So what now? And it's Menes. be a throw-in and out once more now the pass played out wide chance to shoot and he comes up trumps again Oh, that's a stunning save. I mean, his reflexes were incredible then. That's as good a save as you'll see. You can get that clear. Milan are already ahead. The perfect start. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set a high tempo and intensity and look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. Lops it in gently. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. And scored inside the first ten minutes to make it 1 0. Milan get it back again. Abate. It's a forceful run down the right, but he's short of options now. He's there to get rid. Decent enough try. Bonaventura would have known he needed to generate more power behind that, but it just lacked the precision anyway. Looking to shoot. Appearance and very necessary. The Bate. Marcelo did well to step in there. That was more than necessary. Bale. Milan looked all at sea and terribly vulnerable, but they've got away with it. Tries a through ball. Keeper's ball. Sergio Ramos gets it back. Marcelo dinks one in. Marcelo able to come up with a better ball. Yeah, it looked like there that he was asking just a little too much of himself to try and thread that ball through. It was, uh, it was a bit over-ambitious, but I like his thinking. And back out it comes. Modric with the ball through. And the flag has stayed down. Bales cross. Managed to get it away. Fine defending there. Milan are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. It's a 
good throw at all, really. He's given away possession cheaply. Bonaventura, Menez plays it into the channel. Casemiro. Menez, chance! It's Baca! Tremendous from Carlos Baca! And with that goal comes comfort! And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. Milan have a couple of goals without reply. It's 2-0. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Who's going to make this theirs? And it's Baca. Another piece of really good defending. And the first 45 minutes are up. Milan ahead 2-0, and they are looking good. Here we go again. Cristiano Ronaldo. Balotelli. Demanding a quick ball here. And he's made sure that that won't get through. It's got through. Tries to dink it in. Boateng. Pepe does well to read it and intercepts. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Back up. Balotelli looks to dink one in. It's a loose ball. And the defence can get it clear. Looks to thread it through. Abate does well there. Alert. Borte with a long pass. Keylor Navas can hoist it clear. like a good ball through he wasn't very far from making something happen by himself lovely to see Modric hoists it high Milan got lucky they have escaped lightly Now gone. Milan haven't made a substitution yet. And it's Benzema. Christian Zapata positions himself well and cuts it out. Borte tries to loop one option. Balotelli is flagged offside. Batty. Boateng. Sergio Ramos caps it out. Looks to slip it through. Antonelli. It's a good run down the left hand side. Menez. Now it's Menez. It's a long forward pass. Deftly done. Just the goalkeeper to beat. Benzema! And in it goes. Right back in the game. Oh, that was a close call, but for me, he timed his run to absolute perfection there to stay just onside, and he's still a lot to do, you know, but I think he's tucked that away really well. We have got ourselves a game here. 
I think they can sense a comeback here and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Modric tries a long pass towards the front. Bale. That's gone a long way up and away. And Pepe going back to the keeper. And out to safety. Abate with a good steal, well played. Boateng. Modric. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Now it's Baca. Carlos Baca passes it through. Corner then. line a wonderful delivery and all it needed was a touch yeah i just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved he, he scores back to within one interesting a great delivery and a finish to match well look it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header and if you get it slightly wrong then you'll struggle but that was beautifully met it really was Real Madrid get themselves back into contention. Really well taken goal. And surely that does it. Perfect time. Decisive strike. Just so calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a kneel the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Milan could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Daniel Carvajal pumps it forwards. Here it comes. Alatelli pushes to get on the end of it. And Pepe. Keno Navas gets it away. And the referee brings it to a close. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Well, I think when you score with your first effort and goal, there's a good chance that things are uh, going to go your way for the rest of the game. And to be fair, they used the impetus it gave them to gain a level of control.